In addressing you today, I speak in the first person, but with the support and accord of the group. The question we developed through the inquiry process was, what makes jump math work and how is it different? The inquiry has been a worthwhile process in many respects and such a luxury to have time for professional discourse during school time on a topic of such specific interest. This sustained, interactive process of inquiry-based professional development seems a more effective system for PRODI in that it provides opportunities for guided reflection, communication, and collaborative analysis of sincerely relevant pedagogical questions. Mary Fiyun has been an invaluable resource in helping us to determine a focus for our inquiry and in the systematic analysis and articulation of those concepts and strategies which foster our most effective instructional practice. Having said this, I still feel I want to learn more about the connections to brain research and more time to solidify and clearly articulate the key concepts in the JUMP program and how best to implement and share this knowledge. As we communicate with others about the program, I am interested in clarifying that which attracted us to JUMP in the first place and then in continuing to clarify the key concepts underlying the program in the most succinct way possible. We are all so busy and our colleagues have so little time to waste. I want to lure them in with the tiniest, tastiest morsels we have to offer. For my own part, as we have worked through this process, I can see more clearly that JUMP is as beautiful as it has ever been, but in subtle and multifaceted ways that I had not completely articulated before now. <clears throat> These I summarize thus. The unshakable faith in the remarkable plasticity of the brain and its potential for intellect intellectual growth regardless of existing designations and labels. The emotional intelligence and sensitivity to recognize and empathize with those who are struggling, those who excel, and all those in between. The concept of unobtrusively pre-teaching to lower students in order to reinforce the sensibility that no one will be left behind and that making mistakes and forgetting are part and parcel of growth, enhancing the atmosphere of emotional safety, intellectual risk-taking and collective success. The exquisitely delineated lesson plans delivered with enthusiasm, passion and sincere praise that pull out those weaker students and place them safely in the limelight, fostering a phenomenal sense of collective excitement. The beautifully scaffolded workbooks with lessons of extraordinary clarity that are only implemented when success is more or less a given, further reinforcing the growth of positive self-concepts. They are workbooks designed with sensitivity to mitigate language barriers, output difficulties, and struggles with motor function, adding problem solving only after the mathematical concepts are safely rooted. The knowledge base and the mathematical confidence that allows us to create those exquisite bonus questions that keep our faster students engaged and give us the speed to solve them as quickly as they do. The careful daily assessment with mini quizzes, pre-tests and tests, all designed to foster optimal growth, confidence and enthusiasm for learning. And finally, the courage to be vulnerable and reflect openly on our own inadequacies and move forward truly absorbing what it is to be genuinely accountable for our own and our students' development. In some ways, JUMP has such simple appeal, but underlying it is this more complex, intuitive understanding of what makes the mind grow and thrive, what allows a classroom to breathe with excitement for learning. It speaks to those principles of inclusion and compassionate understanding that have the potential to utterly change not just the face of education, but our entire global perspective, very much for the better. It is both subtle and sophisticated, simple and elegant. It is both real and magic, and this is why I love it so much. Even when I am only able to deliver half of the program as it is written, I feel I have done my students a greater service than had I rushed superficially through some poorly understood text leaving at least a third of my children struggling in the unspoken emotional chaos left behind. 
I am very grateful for having had this time to talk and listen and clarify. It is such an honor to work with this group and with Sarah Forsey, our unfailingly supportive math consultant. Thank you.